What up YouTube, it's Misery Hates Company. In this video, we're gonna talk about when we are gonna get transmutation available for Scarlet Witch. Now, while Netmarble has not formally announced when it's going to come to the game, I do have a couple speculations that I think could be realistic guesses and some educated guesses at that. So I wanna talk about both possibilities to you guys right now in this video, because we're at kind of a lull in the game. There's not a lot going on, not really any new content. We're just grinding our invasions and that's basically it. So let's go and look at when I think we're gonna be getting transmutation available for Scarlet Witch. So first things first, um, in uh, Marvel Future Revolution, you'll notice that we do have a couple things going on. If we go to the events tab, the one in particular I want to bring your attention to is Scarlet Witch login. Now, mind you, this was actually brought up in a live stream of mine. So if you want to find this information out when it's hot off the press, instead of in a video, make sure you subscribe to this channel and smash that notification bell so that you can catch me when I go live or my most recent videos, because one of my viewers actually mentioned this and I want to make sure I share with all of you because it actually makes a lot of sense. So like I said, the Scarlet Witch special login is going on for 41 days. That doesn't really matter. I don't think we'll get to that. But if you look at it would make a lot of sense by at the end of the seven weeks when we do get our six star special costume selector box that we get it. So that's one possibility. Uh, the second possibility is truly this 41 days and two hours login uh, for the duration of this event. Now, I think personally, it makes a little bit more sense to get it at the end of the seven weeks. That puts us just around, um, just under that two month threshold. We did get magic in what, four months? Now, I do. I did mention on several of my videos, so I do think that we're gonna be getting Transmutate available to Scarlet Witch a lot faster, but I don't know just how fast. So is just under two months, the time frame again, almost eight weeks, or is it this 41 days? I hope it's not the 41 days and I hope it is possibly this end of the seven weeks. That would make a lot of sense to me. There's a, like I said, there's a little bit of a lull going on. This would help, I think, re-energize the game, even just the slightest bit. It requires close to no development just to allow us to transmutate. I think this would be kind of an easy dub in my book. Now, the other thing, the other timeline that might make sense, so this is like, I guess, a hidden third option would actually be for the uh, one year anniversary event. So we very well could here in the next two months be getting a ton of events for the uh, one year anniversary for Marvel Future Revolution. Hard to believe this game's already been out for a year, but here we are, lo and behold. So like I said, it very well could be either that into the, into the seven weeks, the 41 days, or it could be, again, kind of that 41 days actually would put us pretty close to the uh, one year anniversary now that I look at it again. So that could be it and maybe we'll get lucky and actually be able to get a new hero for the, the new one year anniversary. I don't know, we talked about it a little bit in my live stream and uh, it, people voted and you guys definitely think that we would be getting a new hero for the one year anniversary. I think it's a possibility. Um, Netmarble is doing that thing where they go completely uh, radio silent for a while, which usually means either one of two things. They're working on other projects, which is a very good possibility. They did just come out with a new game. Uh, Neo Kyo, I don't know. Put put in the comments below what it is. I really have no idea. But um, and that game is doing really well. It already earned over one million dollars, so that's pretty awesome for them. Um, it's already doing better than uh, Marvel Future Revolution. But this game is not dying by any means. They have been very open that this game will be going on for at least several more years. It sounds like they have a contract worked out for maybe up to five years. So we got a couple years of this game left. And I plan on making content for it for as long as possible or as long as you guys are watching the content. So thank you for watching this far. If you did make it this far, obviously you liked the video. So smash the like button and let me know in the comments below which one of these timelines makes the most sense to you. Is it the end of the seven weeks, which is just under two months? Or is it maybe around the one year anniversary, which could be right around this 41 day countdown? Again, I think one of the two would make sense to me, but we'll see. I don't know. And until next time, guys, lock it in.